How you get on? Okay. Found a girl. She took her home. Oh. You and Micah find anything? Maybe. I think maybe. I found our old friend, Mr. Cornwall. You did? Yeah. He's buying a stake in the mine in Annisburg. Relentlessly ambitious fella, isn't he? Micah and I'll sniff about, see if he knows we're here, and exactly what his plans are. So, Dodge! Did you miss me? I found her drunk as Saint Denise. You're back. How jolly, Miss it's O'Shea. It's funny, you suck of shit. Back Who and are you? drunk. The master, the Lord Molly. God, almighty. Calm down. I won't be ignored. George Vanderlyn, I am in him. I ain't her. Or any of your stooges. Calm yourself. You don't owe me nothing. Miss. I don't owe you nothing. Nothing. Okay. I'll spit in your eye. I did. I told them. I'm sorry? You know, I told them, and I tell them again. Now I've got God's ear. You told who what? Mr. Milton and Mr. Ross about the bank robbery, and I wanted them to kill you. You did what? I loved you, you goddamn bastard. Go on, She's shoot me. Crazy. She ain't worthy. <laughs> you told on oh, me. You're you not betrayed so big now, me. Why? Just calm down. Arthur? Ah. She's a fool. Get her out of here. You know the rules. You're not so big now. Are we, Your Majesty? You... Take her! <sighs> she knew the rules, Arthur. What the hell is wrong with you? Mr. Pearson, Mr. Williamson, get this body out of here and get it burnt. Okay. Now get back to work, all of you. Quit your lollygagging. Right. Get back to work. Yeah. You're a nasty woman, Miss Crenshaw, a nasty woman. You think I wanted to shoot her? You seem to like it. I saw that beady look in your eyes. You're drunk You gonna again. freeze and your acorns off dressed like that. She broke the rules. She you did okay? no such thing. She was in love. You sour-faced old crone. Goddamn you. Murderer! Murderer! I did what I had to do, Mr. Morgan. Perhaps. I'm worried about you. No, go away, Arthur. Okay. Just want to make sure you're all right. I guess. I didn't really know Molly so well. Thanks for your help. Well, secure in this lovely spot. You okay? About, uh, Molly and everything? If she ratted on us, what could he do but look at this place? I know. Just hang in there for now. You awake yet? <laughs> what? Hey, I'm only trying to improve the mood a bit. Damn it, Arthur. Uh-huh. Let me sleep. Another day. So, here we are. Can't believe that bitch Molly ratted us out. Yeah, if she even did.
You okay, Tilly? Molly got what she deserved. Nearly got us all killed. <sighs> yep. She knew the rules. It'll be okay, Strauss. Okay? They shot Molly. And look at this place. It'll be okay. Well, try to keep your head straight. Okay, right. Molly, I don't believe it. I should have cut her loose months ago. Well, let's get settled into our new home, I guess. How you feeling about Molly? I'm feeling she got exactly what she deserved. That's what I figured. How you doing? Poor Molly. I don't believe it. Oh, she knew the rules. Well, don't give up on everything just yet. All right, then. <laughs> yes, Arthur. Uh-huh. Hi, Uncle. Well, here we are. I can't believe that bitch ratted on us. If she was even telling the truth, the girl was crazy. Okay, guess I'll leave you to it then. Sure, Arthur. Hey, Tilly. Hello. How are you coping? I'd be better if folks stopped fighting, but I'm all right. Yeah, we ain't done yet. Okay, then. I didn't see this coming. Grimshaw did the right thing. Well, let's just see where we go from here. Well, try to keep your head straight. All right. Ah, long day ahead. Oh, hell. How you doing with all this? Scared, worried. Just try to stay strong. All right, then. Hi, Mary Beth. Hi. How are you doing? Bad. I can't take everyone going at each other. Oh, I wish I knew what to tell you. All right, then. <laughs> yes, Arthur. How you feeling? Listen. Listen to me. All of you. here and we are safe now and that is the main thing listen to me you have got to keep faith you've got to now I know I know I miss Jose I surely do. I miss every man and every woman who fell. I do. And I would die in their place gladly if I could. This world is unkind. But it won't break me! Not while I have you by my side. We... We get some money, and we can still... They won't catch me! They won't catch me! And I promise, whosoever stands by my side, they won't catch you neither. They won't. We're still a step ahead of them. 
Just about. Yes, and we must stick together. Now, more than ever before. Okay, Dutch. Hey, get up. Morning. Why don't you sit here away from Micah? How are you coping? People at each other's throats. It's bad. Hopefully we still got a way out of this. All right, Arthur. Sorry, Jack. Where's he gone? Did he run off? I think he must have. Sorry. Well, don't give up on everything just yet. Okay. Okay, Abigail? What are you wearing? You're gonna catch a chill. How you doing with all this? I can't handle people going at each other like this. Just try to stay strong. I guess. I'm very nervous. Very worried. Well, I'm very, very worried. Well, me too, but as long as my girls are okay, I think, well... What are we going to do? So you it's, think... It's a nasty world out there. You think Dutch has lost his mind, Arthur? <sighs> I don't know anymore. I'm not sure I even care. Well, Micah... Micah says you've been saying crazy things about him. Micah. <laughs> Keep an eye out for Micah, Bill. He says a whole lot. I am old. I am frightened. I am so frightened. Excuse me, but everyone has gone crazy. Just try to stay calm. Calm? Look around you, Mr. Morgan. Hello. Hi, Susan. <sighs> Arthur. Hi, Uncle. Hi. How are you doing? Uh, just keeps getting worse. Hopefully we still got a way out of this. Yep, Arthur. Hey, why don't you sit a while?
Why is everyone acting so crazy, Morgan? I guess folk are real scared. We'll be fine. We always have been. Now, Dutch will see us good. I hope so. Not you as well. Another fella doubting them? You know, I thought... I thought more of you, Morgan! It fades. Trust me, it fades. What fades? Your youthful bloom. It fades, and it's a horror what's left. Don't be like that, Miss Grimshaw. I know how you girls laugh at me. I used to laugh at women just like me when I was young and pretty and sure of the world. We don't laugh at you, miss. You do. And you're right, too. I'm laughable. Pitiable. But it'll happen to you, too. They'll stop looking soon enough, and that glass in your hand won't be so friendly, neither. Tell her, Mr. Morgan. Tell her about time. I don't know too much about time, Miss Grimshaw. That's a bit beyond me. Well, maybe I'll get lucky and die first. Yes. Well, get to work! Vanity won't help you, young or old. Miss Grimshaw? Oh, Arthur, you fool! Go get some warm clothes! Good morning. Yeah? How you doing with all this? Do I sound like I'm doing great? Uh-huh. I guess. Do you have any warmer clothes, Arthur? Hey, Karen. How are you doing? Top of the world! We'll be all right. Yeah, yeah. It's all over. All over. It's... I don't want to die. Not like this, not... I don't want that. I don't... You... It's all so sad, Mr. Morgan. So very sad. I... I don't know. I don't know. Pearson? Oh, hello. How are you coping? Well, I'm alive. Uh-huh. Sure. How are you handling everything? Things have been better. Ain't much good these days. You can sit, but we ain't in much of a good mood.
Uncle. How are you doing? I had enough of all this. Oh, I wish I knew what to tell you. <laughs> Yippers. Charles. You're not exactly dressed for cold weather. How are you coping? Do you really need to ask? Just try to stay strong. Yeah. Stay alert there, Javier. Arthur? How you doing with all this? Yeah, I'm okay. Yeah, gotta stay positive. Whatever you say. Can I talk to you a second? Sure. I'm just so worried about Karen, Arthur. Why? You know why. She's gonna kill herself when she hits the liquor. Sure, but... But I guess that's her choice. I'll try speaking with her. Thanks, Arthur. I'll try too. But... We both know it won't work. Missed you, boy. You showed up when you did. Oh, the things he said he'd do to me. It's all right, ma'am. It's over now. Thank you. Again. Let's go, boy. Nice folks around here. Yep. Easy, whoa. <laughs> oh. Hands up! <laughs> you 
trying to rob a sick man? I was trying to help. Uh, bullshit you was. I hope you move fancy boots. Unlike you, I was honorable. An explanation why you're here? All right, simmer down. Thanks for stopping, sir. Thank you. Um, Percy Whitsickle, Central Union Railroad Company. Maybe you can help me. One of my... One of my... One of my workers has been stealing wages. Three weeks running. I have searched everyone and everywhere ten times over. Of course, no one is talking <laughs> the way they look at me. What's all this got to do with me? Oh, uh, I just, I think I need someone a little more neutral, a little more persuasive. And, and, and you look like you're, uh, you know, and I got to watch the camp, so could you see what you could sniff out? I'll pay you for your efforts, of course. Yeah, I got it. What exactly is it you want me to do? Find the thief and recover the money. And give him his marching orders. I'm not one for matters of personnel. Look for anyone sneaking off the line. They've got to be stashing it away from camp somewhere. Well, can you help me? My head is on the block here. <laughs> Everyone here is so selfish. I'll see what I can do. Thank you. Thank you. We offer you honest work for honest pay, and you steal from us. It's disgusting. Come on. Come on. What are you doing over here? What are you doing? <clears throat> you can't up spend a whole month's wage in a pair of new California moccasins. All right, I gotta go for a piss. Y'all keep at it. I'll hear it if you don't. Hey, friend. Hello there. I haven't heard from my family. Why may they sound sensi guo?
Whoa! What are you doing here? Doing your friend Percy a little favor. He says one of the workers has been stealing. I reckon I just found him. Stealing? <laughs> what? I, I'm the junior foreman here. It, it's them Orientals you want to speak to. You ready to return that money you stole? Okay, okay. All right, all right. I'm leaving. The money is in the tree. Just please don't kill me. Hey, mister. Hello. My boss sent me to me to tell me that I was going to get his money. He's still not going to get it. I don't know how to do it. It's like this every day. I got your money. Here. You're going to need a new junior foreman, though. He just quit. Randall? I don't believe it. Well, that does explain a few things. Thank you for your help, partner. Here, for your trouble. gets closed and yet my brother's allowed to reopen. Makes no sense. Whoa! State your side, sir! North or South? State your side or I'll shoot! Inner selling. Okay, let's take a look at it. I hope 
make good use of that. Real good doing business with you. So you got a girl, mister? Yeah, uh, not anymore. Me neither. Got my eye on one, though. I was hunting north of Annisburg when I came across this cabin. And there's no one there but this woman. Bit bony, but beautiful as the day is long. Real elegant fancy type, too. You got a problem with women or something? Don't know what she's doing out there in the middle of nowhere, but turns out she's a widow. She asked me to leave, but in a real nice way. M made me feel good. I watched her from the bushes for a while, saw her cry. Sure. I won't tell you then, if that's how you want to be. If ladies ain't your thing, you can kelp me the hell out of this. Easy roads and kind weather, friend. I wouldn't waste your time panning this stretch. This here's all shit, <laughs> and no shine. Well, 
Hope you find some shine. I'll leave you uh. to it. It's in Whoa. me. They're in me. Yeah, you're not well, friend. Uh, Butch's crick. Butch's crick. Uh, where? Uh, Butch's crick. Is that where you're from? Butch's crick. You want me to take you back, or They're in uh, me? Uh, come on, let me get you home. Butchers, Crick. God voices. Damn it. Some distress. <laughs> yeah, he uh, seems calmer now. I found him out in the woods. Well, Lemuel, sweet Lemuel, such a nurse man, such a good man. Come here, no, come on. Get up here, help you. Since the troubles began, he just he's not the same. It's in me. Why is he looking at me funny? Uh, no, he he's not well. It's 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 the darkness. It, he said it's the darkness. Who says it's the darkness? Well, the village is... Well, thank you, sir. Hey, thank, thank you for lim... Ah, me! Please, please, sir. Ah, ah, them you are not well, sir. Uh, you got yeah. anything for me? Oh, yeah. Of course, sir. Love and friendship in the darkness. What else are there? Obadiah Hinton, that's me. Yeah. <laughs> love and friendship, friendship and love. We're not a rich village, sir, but with love, rich. We thank uh, you. Okay. Hey there. 